Tonight, Chesterfield residents are fired up over the county's plan to rezone more than 2,000 acres to build schools, homes, and a technology village. Community members are concerned that a slew of traffic and other problems will follow. They protested outside and inside a community meeting tonight. Thanks for joining us for 8 News at 11. I'm Eric Phillips. I'm Deanna Albritton. 8 News reporter Sabrina Shutters is live in Chesterfield tonight. And Sabrina, what did these protesters have to say about this development? Well, Eric Deanna, even though no vote was taken on this project today, there certainly was no shortage of outbursts from the crowd and people protesting this project. Now, that's with dozens of people showing up to voice their concerns. Not in anyone's backyard. The message echoed by crowds of Chesterfield residents like Victoria Sagstetter. This is not appropriate for Mosley. Protesters like Cindy Kirk calling the project Magnolia Megasite. I suspect some sneaky stuff was done where they tried to do this behind closed doors. The project would bring a technology village similar to Meadowville Technology Park. At least two different schools plus as many as 600 homes. And Sagstetter says the plastic manufacturing it would be zoned for isn't good. It's close to future school sites. Plastic manufacturing could be detrimental to the Swift Creek watershed. So there are just a lot of issues. County leaders stressing that the project would boost the area's economy. Resident Cindy Kirk hoping this protest will cancel the project. Someone in the crowd asking Deputy County Administrator Jesse Smith if there's any support from residents on this. Smith answering the question with laughter heard in the background. I, I would say yes. Um, there is support. I, I know I've talked to folks. There is support from a large portion of the community. Now, the county has made some changes to that original proposal, and you can find the full breakdown of those changes in this story at WIC.com. Now, the next meeting to discuss those changes will be next Friday. For now, live in Chesterfield, Sabrina Shutters, 8 News.